Hey everybody, Rodamon here. Thanks for tuning in to episode 74 of The Wendigos, which originally streamed live on Twitch October 17th. No changes to the rules or goals, but here they are as a reminder. And last stream, which is, I guess, five episodes ago, we added Save Our Ship 2, and we've been working on that ever since. Let's get going. Well, that is a pretty sizable chunk of their raid just on fire and bleeding and whatnot. Uh, they're going to use low shields on me. I'm just going to keep backing up. The rest of my guys are going to be around this corner here while they fight. Uh, what else could I do to them? Chelsea, you've got some side powers left. All right, I am splitting my attention, so i got to be careful about that. Uh, Cruzio and... Oh, Cub, you're at the back. Cruzio and Reds. Let's get you out this door. Uh, Chelsea, looks like there's a really good pulse opportunity here. And good slice. What do we do to him? Good old... All the way down the torso. Okay, take a look over here. Back up. Flick, go deal with this cheeky guy using my own... You know, actually, there's a lot of them. Don't even worry about it. You want to use my own barricades? You're going to have to follow me out here to use them. Alright. Getting you out of position. Savanti, you have another pulse. Uh, Latin Deer, can you invisible Savanti? Joy, all you go this way. There's the low shield. Uh, Wolf, you've got chunk skip. Thank you. Most of us are brawlers. But Sylvanti and I are not. Brawlers stay in the pocket. All right. Oh, you're dead. Oh, right. Uh, Wolf, you don't have your weapon because I made you take a doomsday launcher. So... There is not a good reason for you to be here. Dub, Chelsea, Soulblader, and Ox. Join me up here. Wolf, go get your weapon. I don't think side casting for Wolf's gonna play much of a role. Call to treatment. Uh lucky shot, let's say. Oh, you missed. Alright, so here comes the brawlers. My brawlers are on their way. Alright, that looks like a good opportunity. Ooh, good shot. And back down here. Yeah, we're just cleaning up. I don't even need to pay attention to them for a moment. Splat! There goes another body. So Manti took a hit. Probably superficial, I'm assuming. Chelsea! Yeah. Throw them in disarray. Do not throw your Molotov. If you throw your Molotov, I'll be very mad. And you're fleeing. All right. 90 enemies. All. Cruzio, just keep firing. Kill the sis. 
right, we are working on a ship, so as much as I would like to torture and chase and murder all these guys, I will do that only to the ones that are currently down. And, uh, alright, Soul Blader, you can get Hiroto. Actually, get, uh, Kazuko. Oh, wow. Alright, bye-bye, Kazuko. D uh, my, they're, they're having fun. I'm gonna let them have their fun. Even the ones that are down deserve some death. Don't discriminate. Are you bloodlust? No, you're not. Alright, go back in. And Soul Blader, kill Hiroto. We're done. Wolf, unconscripted, undrafted, whatever you want to call it. And that would be it. Oh, you know, what is your needs? Killed someone three or four. Let's go for five. Eh, let them burn. Let them burn. Let them burn. Why not? That worked out quite nicely. <laughs> hey, sticky bumps. Thanks for the resub. Almost at a half a year. All right, it's. Uh, I don't think we suffered any permanent injuries from that that need tending to other than, um, oh, right, the, the new guy. Oh, man, so, um, obviously I'm seven minutes overdue. Uh, what I'm going to do is, like, you've got 30 seconds. I don't know why I have five fingers, but, uh, you got 30 seconds, and, um, if you really, really want the new Wendigo Cub, uh, because I was busy, just type something in general chat if you're a subscriber and, uh, you could potentially get the Cub. It's just, you know, I was in the middle of the big raid, so understandably I wasn't really able to do the uh, the raffle. It's it, it it's my MO. My MO is saying I'm going to do something, put it on a timer, and then never do that. All right, so here we go. There's 37 of you eligible, and Cruzio, I'm guessing you're going to keep your char character, so I'm going to re-roll this. Loosed Viper. Congratulations. Loosed Viper, are you? No. Okay, you don't have a character? Right? I don't think. Congratulations. I'm gonna put that. Just gonna call you Loose Viper. And then of course there is another there's another one. There is Narda, who is um eighty six percent over her addiction, so she's gonna roll in pretty soon here too. She'll be added as well. So, Loose Viper, if you're curious about your skills and passions, you're a physically dull, tough cannibal who has a burning passion for shooting and doesn't ever do art. You're currently set up to handle animals, hunt, and then uh, clean, as every new guy cleans. Oh, yes! I don't know where it is, but we just got... Um, yeah, we got some gold. All right. Nice. Good job, turtle. Turtle, turtle. But now find me some Plasteel. I know that's a tall order, but that's what I want. I'll still build this anyway, just in case we need a place to put the uh, uh, the power source. The, the what is it called? Uh, unstable power cell? Hey, what the heck? Hi, Pits. I'm going to give you a window hug. Window hug time. I don't even, we just hit him in the arm and he died. Cool. Dub leveling up a big in melee. 
Come on, fire, spread. Burn. Caster Analyzer and a Bionic Leg. Hmm. Ha! <laughs> a Bionic Leg and their Body Purist. Um. All right. Question. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. Oh, oops. I probably should have done the other one. Damn, you're still down? Jesus, you've been unconscious for like... Three and a half days? Yikes. Alright, uh, Sylvanti. Let's go get Hale. Or Hall, whatever their name is. Michael C. Hall. Over there. Who's got my bionic leg for me? Uh Oh right, I don't have a warden anymore. Uh Wardens. So Savanti already used her Inspiration, so we'll put everybody that can warden back on wardening so uh, Narda actually gets fed, because right now she's a little hungry. Just a little bit. It's not my fault. Alright, we're going to tear this, uh, this raider's leg off and then uh, sacrifice them, I guess. Found some more steel. Could not care less. Uh, who has an inspiration for surgery? Glitch, you do. Remove left leg. Herbal meds only. Give me that leg, girl. There's the bionic leg. And then, uh... That worked. <sighs> yep. All right, turtle sandwich. I'm going to put you back on tomb. Because glitch is in there. Come on, you can rekindle it. Uh, actually, well, Ox, I'm going to try to remember that turtle sandwich has an inspiration. So as soon as Ox gets close to finishing this bed... Uh, I will switch it to Turtle Sandwich. Alright, this is a hospital again. Now that means I... There. I don't... Actually, yeah, there we go. The leg is for Narda. The other leg. Right, one of them is going to go to Loose Viper, um, and the other one's going to go to Narda. Basically, all of our Wendigos get at least one advanced leg and get uh, an exoskeleton suit so they can outrun or chase down, etc., etc., etc. I guess that to some degree or another, Gaster Analyzer would have been good for my cooks, but like. Oh well. Uh, animals, you are free to help haul. I forgot about that. And then everyone else, you're free to go wherever you want, except for Turtle Sandwich, who's being unnecessarily penalized for being broken up with. Hey, they're on, um... No, not Turtle Sandwich. Okay. I was going to say, I thought they were on good terms, but they're not. So, let's see. Seven days and ten days? That's kind of a good long time to be, uh, you know, psychically paired. So hopefully something positive of that happens. All 
I can leave these doors open. Come on, please build that. And in fact, remove this. Add it here. I really gotta, like, watch my constructors. I'm very curious what they've been working on. Because I feel... Oh, Turtle, you're just asleep. I feel like, um... I'm just not making a lot of ship construction progress. And I don't know why. Oh, you know what it is? It's not part of safety, is it? Every time I put them into safety, they can't go out there. No, they can't. I mean, that makes sense. They shouldn't be able to, right? It's time. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to allow it. Let's add this zone to safety. But that, that was why. Okay. Cleaning up some memory. Beer coming down from Warm Cigarette. Beer helps me start relationships. But well, your name is Warm Cigarette, so I'm guessing it's both. Uh, masterwork and Turtle Sam, would you climb immediately right into it? Wait, don't you have a bed? Oh, right, you broke up with Glitch. Huh, I guess you live here now. Uh, I'm alright with it. <laughs> I'll let it be. That works for me. Or Glitch broke up with you, I should say. It's a pretty cold place to live. It's pretty awful. But it is right next to the re uh, the ground penetrating radar, which is where uh, she lives, basically. I think it would be a little bit nicer if it was uh, in here, Turtle. And well, you'll get your sleep disturbed, but at least you won't be cold and it isn't awful. It is extremely impressive. Alright, come on, Constructors. You're disappointing me. Yeah, she's yelling, no, I'm not going to go back to that guy. You're absolutely right. But he is Father Wendigo. So even if it's a bit of a the Hills of Eyes scenario, I, I think we're going to encourage it to happen. Ox has inspired surgery. All right, now that everything's pulled out of here, I can just knock it to the ground. And it looks like uh, Ox is now prioritizing building the ship radiator, so that means that the ship is going to start getting progress, which is good. Because it's been just sitting here, not being progressed upon for a while now. Am I really that low on steel? Damn. Well, maybe we'll get bulk goods or something. Steel's really, really tricky to help long-term or long-distance transport because it's heavy unlike gold or silver or something so still is a little bit annoying like that that and i think we're just constantly machining new shield belts and whatnot did someone say bought goods i did it's not what i got but i appreciate what i got there's a lot of mechs to shred for steel. Yes, it's true. I do have shred mechanoid forever queued up. Uh, one thing I could do to... Animals could help haul... There we go. Animals are going to help haul mechs a little bit better now. They're allowed into the mech corpse drop zone. As soon as Tolerin's done with that shield belt, um, my... They will be hauling... or They will be shredding mechs. Hell, you have been sick for so long. All right, taking a look over here. Okay, the radiators are getting built. Oh, there's the antimaterial rifle for Narda. Uh, who made it? Where is it? Oh, uh, Phoenix has it. It's excellent. Okay, it's good enough. I mean, obviously, Masterwork's better, but it is what it is. Looks like I'm getting backed up on um, apparel and the like, so I'm going to lower this requirement here and start burning apparel uh, as a priority, just so that I don't get so littered. It's debilitating.
a jade meter, right? That'll be really, really good for art. That will lower my need for uh, bone china. So thank you. Uh, who sent that? Morpheus. Thanks, Morpheus. And exotic goods. Hopefully something useful this time. Yeah, I didn't even check the um, the last one, to be honest. Because I so much didn't need it. I basically have no use for the prosthetics. I'll, I'll check it, though. Yeah, nothing. I mean, not surprising. But for the exotic goods, I could, for, I could sell... Uh, well, I have a lot of flake. I could sell... Ooh, they have an architect leg. I could sell gold to them. Now that I have deep drill gold, I think I'm going to do that. Just so that I have the silver so that if I do happen upon... Um, if I do happen upon... A fortuitous trade with a uh, trade core or something, I can trade it. Right now, I would say I'm probably pretty rich in... Textiles. Okay, there's the trade. It's not a lot of silver, but it will have to do. Uh, what about marble? Yeah, I have a lot of, uh, you know, you're right. I have a ton of, um, let's do that. I have a ton of blocks that I could be turning into statues. I don't even care. Let's make it not out of granite in case I want granite. But that is a very good point. I don't even care what they make out of it other than that. So, uh, Bruce, thanks for that, uh, that suggestion. Uh, you said there's not much of a point selling gold to them. Well, the thing is, uh, traders only have a certain amount of total inventory, right? So, the idea of selling to this exotic goods trader is if the n next one, you know, has a tech core, I might as well try to get all of their silver as well. And if they don't have a tech core, you know, it's like always... it, it Having excess silver on hand is a lot better than having excess... Material that you don't intend to use, in my opinion. Um. Oh, Balkids. Well, speak of the devil. They shall appear. Uh, Balkids, I'm probably going to bulk bones to them. More than anything else. But also, I'm, I might bulk buy steel. I'm not exactly sure if I want to. But bone, for sure. Oh, and twisted meat. Hmm. Okay, I can sell bear skin to you and a ton of this human leather. I'm going to keep some of it for dusters, but... Uh, I'm probably going to bulk buy steel. That, I think, to me, makes sense. Because I'm falling behind on it, and I need to sell it. Or I need to uh, acquire some, I should say. Honestly, the old furnitures, even the royal bed, I'm just going to get rid of. Standing lamp. And flake. And then... Oh, they didn't, uh, they didn't... Did they not want bone? Or did I over... Oh, I overlooked it. I could also buy some Luciferium off, uh, off them, but I, I'm really interested in just making the most amount of money possible. So I'll sell all the bone that's in that zone. And let's move this up here. Hey, 
and sell this bone as well. So I have 900 to play with. I can't think of anything more important. I'm going to buy a little bit of cloth um, because we, we make it into medicine. And then the rest will just be Luciferium. Done. Pretty fortuitous trades, I'd say. We emptied out a ton of our unnecessary bone supply. And then a prosthetics trader. I'm not even going to check it. Sorry, Hobo. <laughs> I appreciate the attempt, but oh my god. Those prosthetics plague me. Alright, so the added steel is going to help me help this put this ship together. I don't know. I guess I'll check it. Maybe they have something like I overlook that is important. What are they called? The VA Traveler? VA Travelers? Alright. Uh, they have a cornea implant. I don't have the money for that. Otherwise, I would want it. it. Makes your shooters better. Speaking of shooters better, uh, you haven't even changed your anything yet. I suppose I haven't given you uh, bionics either. So that's my fault. We should have, yep, there it is. So Chelsea, I'm going to free you up from whatever else you're working on. No more growing, straight to art. We have plenty of growers that are more capable than you. Sly, or Sill, or whatever, Sill. Yeah, I'm going to call you Sill. Bye-bye. I hope you enjoyed your, your stay in the burn ward that is the Wendigo base. My goodness. Overstated is welcome much. All right, Tolerian, I'm gonna force you to um, to work on bionics. We definitely fall behind what I wanted to make there. Uh, the quest. So, what do you guys think? Should I do? Here, I'll have you vote. Should I do the crown quest? Yes. No. Don't care. So the advantages here would be we kill six pirates we with two soldiers. Circadian influence is nice, but I don't really know if I'm going to be dedicating advanced components towards it. Uh, and the gold is obviously pretty meaningless because that's a tiny amount. But uh, you all can vote anyway. Uh, it would be somewhat helping out the crown, I guess, but they it doesn't help our relationship. They just pay us in uh, tech print and some gold and whatever we find at the camp. Uh, the advantage of this one would be they send a ship to me to pick up my fighters. So I don't have to travel there and I don't have to travel home. It's just sort of instant, uh, which is, I suppose, convenient. But we'll have you all vote. It's kind of looking like a no. Alright. Yeah, circadian influence is nice for the half cyclers. Or not the half cyclers, the other one. The, um... What are they called? Uh, the assistant. It makes you have to rest left off less often. The half cyclers uh, means you never have to sleep, but it just... It addles your brain is, I guess, the best way to put it. It, uh... It... Gives you a little bit of a disability there. So these radiators take a lot of steel, which is why it's taken a while to get them built. Do people pray when there is a bed in there? Mm, that's a good question. Looking at their side focus, I would say yes. Oh, actually, no. You're right. That is a problem. Um, well, Toral Sandwich, for the good of everybody, 
you're going to be shacking up with your ex anyway. Let's get rid of this bed. And I'm going to make you stand next to him. I wish I could just, much how animals could be instructed to just, like, follow pawns around. I wish it was just like, hey, follow this person. Shadow them. Don't let them out of your sight. It is your job to tail them. I have, uh, I think, six shells where they don't belong, so I'm going to move them. Come on. Love's in the air. I put it there. <laughs> Watch Turtle Sandwich like form a connection with one of the other side casters. Uh, so here's another. Oh, uh, overlapping. So I'm going to ignore the quest. And then here's another vote up there. Right? I can't reach it because it's out of view. But um, Yoda wants you to vote. Yoda wants you to vote. Just whisper the bot and let them know. And I got another quest available, Menace Pods. The Agonquin Wendigos want to send a mech cluster at me. I'll have a defoliator, which is a big old joke because there's no foliage. A countdown timer, four proximities, four unstables, gloom lights, mech capsules, drop beacons, assemblers, sluggers, infernos, and charge. But no auto mortars. That's important. They don't have any auto mortars. Uh, they will give me... It doesn't really pay for itself, if I'm being perfectly honest. It, uh... This is pretty lackluster rewards, given the strength of this cluster. But once, once this vote is up, I'll have you vote on whether I accept this. I think I would lean towards um, the Auxiliary AI, Glitteral Medicine, and Plasteel. Um, but we'll see. Oh, okay. I was like, relations? What relations? Ship's looking better. The music is quieter. I think it's just this specific song that is not balanced all that well. You sent me ship chunks. Thank you, guys. Turtle Sandwich is like, I'm hungry. Well, you know what? You have a lavish meal in your pocket. Eat that. Stop complaining. Oh, Glitch isn't even here, so... You're free. And then animals... Do I have... No, I don't have you locked up. That's good. Another exotic goods from Tur Teddy. I almost called you Turtle. Do I have enough stuff to sell to them, though? I have some really... Whoa, Chelsea, what the heck happened here? A stand sandstone uh, sculpture at normal quality. It's like the worst thing I've ever seen her make, ever. But, you know, whatever. Can't all be winners. Okay. I could part with the Hyperweave. Oh, uh, they have a tech core. Alright. Oh, dear lord. Can I afford this? Um, no. <laughs> Just like, no. Not without, like, selling pets or something else that's important. Um, hmm. Well, I don't have a de uh, I don't even have a lot of gold in the pink link's getting some more, but I don't even have gold saved up. Yeah, no, I don't really don't have anything here. The hyperweave that I have there, I'm saving for a very specific reason, Cruzio. Um, maybe I don't actually need it, but like uh, with e EPOE, synthetic organs require hyperweave to manufacture, and they're better than um, they're better than 
normal organs. They're sort of like bionic. So you can have like bionic lungs and livers and kidneys and all that. But um, I think the re realistically, I'm probably never going to travel down that tech line, given that we have the save our ship stuff. Uh, so yeah, maybe I'll make dusters with that uh, instead. And sell the dusters. But uh, the dusters wouldn't want to be... No one's going to want to purchase them. Um, yeah, no one's going to want to purchase them. Or uh, Exotica's not going to want to purchase them anyway. Tumbling satellite. That was a hell of a meteorite. I mean, it broke my walls, but I'll take it. Because it's a lot of blast deal. Narda's progress is done. Hey, let's recruit you. Uh, her resistance remaining is still pretty ridiculously high, to be honest. So it's going to be a while for us to recruit her. And it's not even that her mood is bad, right? Like, we're actually keeping her pretty happy. She's just a pain in the butt to recruit, I guess. All right, Tolerin, finish that leg. Because we want loose Viper not hobbling around on one leg here. That's a totally avoidable thing to do. And then also we're going to want an excess two exoskeleton suits. Yeah, just a stubborn prisoner. I'm probably going to change these walls around too. You forgot the quest poll? True, I did. So, menace pods. There's the bowl. And Maya, we're saying no to you. It's pretty unlikely that we ever really accept a crown quest unless the rewards are really, really extraordinarily good. So, fission reactor. That's going to be something we're going to need. It's going to be a nose. Eventually, the sort of um, beautiful layout of the ship is going to be lost, if I'm going to be honest. But, there's not, not much that I can do about that. Landir, inspiration, you are going to be able to shoot accurately. I don't think you've ever shot a gun in your life, so cool. And then turtle sandwich. Oh, right as glitch gets there. That relationship might be unsalvageable. At least without like extraordinary intervention. So that, uh, that exotic goods passed by. I just wasn't going to get close enough to the required trade in order to affect anything there. What is all this apparel? It's all tainted, right? Burn apparel. Yeah, I'm just going to force two of these guys that are just walking by to burn some apparel. Scanned underground uranium. It sounds good, but I have so much overground uranium. That it's really not that all that helpful. So you're telling me to do it? Do the uh, the menace pods. Okay. Got it. I'm going to accept for... The metal... Oh, right, and the... Oh, God, you guys. 
the help. Please, pods, show up immediately. Please, 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 please. I'm not going to name these guys. I really hope that the menace pods... Okay, here it is. Showed up immediately. Oh, my lord. You guys are going to die. All right, uh, schedule. Safety. And animals. Safety. Hey, if, if their leader wanted it done, thy will be done, but not without some sizable sacrifice. <laughs> Gotta pay the Reaper. All right, I'm gonna wait till Teddy is not in the danger zone. Um. I'm gonna cut, put my um, so my gun happy people on the mortars, making sure that they're sending high explosive shells. They are. Uh, maybe not you, M. I'm gonna put uh, Flick here on this one because all of my all of my. Uh, Anti-material rifles are probably going to have to deal with the uh, mechanoids. I like how there's not a single sleeping mech here. Right? A part of me almost wants to... Um... You guys want to see something dirty? Yeah, you want to see something dirty. Actually, it makes more sense if uh, someone that can skip does it. Chelsea, can you skip? Yeah, you can. All right, you do it. Oh, don't eat. No, no eating. What do you don't haul? Do you, are you refusing to haul? I hate you. I don't actually hate you, but my goodness, lady, stop trying to fight me. This is happening. All right, so hold fire on all these. Um, my guests here. A fitting sacrifice to the Blood God and the All Black. Oh, there's a giant stack of shells in the middle of the assembler. I wonder how that got there. No, I don't wonder. I don't wonder at all. Actually, you know what? Let's use... Not that I intend to keep these guys alive, but let, let's let's use the free cover here. Oh, I missed Neville. No, I didn't miss anyone. 
A fitting sacrifice to the blood god and all black. Alright, yep. And I have a low shield to deploy here. Let me move these guys around so that I can low shield right at the start. Alright, do they have, uh... I guess I didn't check. Do they have any uh, mortar shields? I don't think so. I don't see any. So... Here we go again, force a target who can shoot the shells. And let's leave these doors open. In fact, uh, uh, Soul Blader, I'm going to have you prop them open. Ooh, we're doing it. We're doing it. Good shooting. Good shooting. <laughs> All right. Well, there's always another shot. Blood is down. As soon as the uh is there any other what drugs do you have? Take drug, yeo, go juice, consume the go juice. I like how my guys are not, they're utterly unconcerned with that fight. They're just like, ah, fighting, cool. Come on, shells. Why you gotta be so disappointing? Alright, are they firing? Yeah, they're firing. Black is not drafted? Oh no, he isn't. You saw, or disappointing. Well, God just died. Hey, can you be like the torchbearer that try? Okay, no, you can't. You're already dying. Here, you stay there. Can you shellers? Do your job? Nope. 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 Okay. So right now, um... Flick Hammer and Perpetual Ox could really wreak havoc on these things. Right? Because they, I could skip them in and just blow those because this is a tight cluster. Or I could just keep shelling it. I'm not all that worried about the rest of the me mech cluster. Yeah, your method of not aiming for the thing I want to hit, probably valid. What I'm going to do after this shot is uh, switch to incendiaries and see if I can just set... No, I kind of want the steel. I'm not going to switch to incendiaries. Alright, let's go. Chelsea, you should be on... Ooh, Manhunter Pack. That will do it. Oh, 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 that's a lot of polar bears. Or grizzly bears. I know my animals. Uh, put you on safety. Get out of there. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. That was nice, yeah? A real big bang. That would have looked much cooler as an opening attack, I think, than it did as a eventually, eventually. Oh, too close. Pink. Run, pink, run! Woohoohoohoo! Spicy a meatball! The died. Alright, 
let's not let these pikemen shred us. Fitting died. So I basically can't get any closer than this marble. Got it. Or the uh, auto turrets will start to go crazy. Hmm. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. You guys are done. All right. Totally, totally done. Next up. All right, so they have one power cell left. I wasn't too uh, too concerned about the power cell. It wasn't my primary motivation. Uh, these assemblers are making scythers. There. My range can go away. And died. I actually ranged all but pink link go this way. We got some unbearable problems. Alright, so they still have uh, an auto charge turret. But that's a solvable issue. Uh, Reds and Cruzio, I haven't forgotten about you. Pink Link, how hurt are you? You're not that hurt. You have a little burn on your jaw, and a little burn on your exoskeleton. I think you'll be alright. Uh, you guys over here. Alright, are we all here? Is this everybody? Yep. Soon bears will die. Coming for you. Oh, you broke my shield. I don't want Flick to get extra shot. So put in someone that has a shield. Flick, you can destroy the assemblers. Ooh, a bunny. All dead. Touch this. Done. Oh, look at that sacrifice. Well, that's how you do a mech cluster. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. I'm going to temporarily unsuspend their uh, movement. so that I can move stuff around. Sacrifice just died. That seems fitting. I got my reward. This bear just got shot in the head like five times. That was amazing. 
All right, everyone stack up here. Uh, who has a jetpack? Phoenix, you are going to go for this door, close it. And this door, open it. And Sylvanti, you're going to go for this door and open it after closing that one. Oh, you went that way, huh? Okay, I guess I should have specified, so that's my bad. I, uh... Yeah. Should have just realized that you would have just... done it the wrong way. Well, luckily, she only got mauled once, which is not that big of a deal. Uh... Wolf. Go repair this door. Phoenix, you are going to go then path this way. Typical Savanti, yeah, indeed. Alright, so Phoenix is opening this door so that the polar bears can pour on out. We're already starting to get polar bears over here because they are they don't have a valid path on me. Yeah, you can just open that now. There we are, and then jump to cover. This was held open. And now we should be getting polar bears of many here. And if, if they don't start spilling in, I'm going to actively hunt them. Oh, we have a raid. From the south. Cannibal hunting. Okay. Well, I'm not even going to worry about that raid because it's... I don't know. Because I'm not worried. Because they're... The garbage. Alright, but everybody at this point should be scheduled safety. Especially Soul Blader, who is trying to save the sacrifice. Please, just burn their bodies entirely. I don't want to deal with them. And this raid was... Yeah. Cannibal hunting. Okay, it was a normal raid. Uh, we also have auxiliary AI up here. I think it would make sense if Sylvanti got it. Um, because her sister also has one. So they'll be the angels of mercy and death. Right? You know, Sylvanti and, and Chelsea both are surgically evil. Makes sense. Oh, are you gonna mess with my gloom light? Or are you gonna are you gonna kidnap them? That'd be hilarious. Uh, Wolf, I don't know why you're not conscripted, but let's have you go fight and then flick Chelsea Soulblader. Let's go fight. Glitch, you're held in reserve in case someone that isn't supposed to come through my door comes through the door. Turtle sandwich, go flirt with the old man. No, they're not trying to kidnap. Okay. One of them's getting through. <laughs> that that was, was short-lived. Now, I could perhaps recruit them, but I think I have enough pets at this point. Damn, Chelsea. You cut off both legs? In one, one, two swings? That's efficiency. Oh, and you bashed them so hard they collapsed to death. In a puddle of their own. Stupidity for raiding the wrong people. Alright, well, they're gone. Everybody is safety scheduled except for Turtle Sandwich, who is hanging out in the tomb. And Glitch already left. Uh, my current count is what? Just two polar bears? One polar bear left? Let's see. Enemies. Yes. Literally one polar bear left. Done. 
Blood just died. Two in black should die soon, too. I just have to wait. <clears throat> Gotta wait for him. Blood died from bloodlust, yes. Yes, indeed. Nine, six, three, and you're dead. And now two is the only one left, and he's got three hours. Are polar bears brown? Uh, well, I can be. They roll in the mud, but yeah, they're grizzlies. Point taken. Thank you for watching The Wendigos, episode 74. If you have any feedback for me, do drop me a line in the comments below. Keep in mind that there's one hour left of this stream yet to air. If you'd like to catch a live one, well, you know where to go. Rodamont.com has really all the resources you need. Thanks for watching. I'll catch y'all next episode. Adios, everybody.